wanted a retro looking custom helmet to go with my bike. So I got this Bell 500 helmet that was on sale because I guess nobody liked the uh, design that was on there. And uh, I've already got some of these Time Warp wet sanding sponges, 600 grit, and gone over it and scuffed it all up and masked off the snaps. And I'm going to go with a gloss black paint job and I got some um, images of Frankenstein off the internet and did a little editing, uh, kind of tinted it uh, a light blue. I'm gonna put um, a portrait of Frankenstein on each side, about right here. And then I'm going to freehand with my airbrush some lightning bolts uh, going across the top. And, um, I decided I'm gonna do the lightning first that way I don't get overspray on my uh, water slide decal. So this is just the beginning of it. This is just kind of the glow from the bolts. I'm gonna go over that with some blue and then uh, put in the thinner actual lightning bolts on top of that. And then uh, I'll... here it is with the black base coat and the lightning done. I think I'm probably gonna place the uh, Frankenstein water slide somewhere like that. And I'm not sure if I'm going to keep the background that is around the water slide. It's kind of a blue tint um, stone wall. Or if I'm just going to cut it out around his head like this and do just like a little bit of a glow with my airbrush around it but the actual water slide's not gonna be black and white like that. It's gonna have a, a bluish tint to it to uh, kind of go with the lightning bolts. I don't have the patience to be a purist on this project. So these are the water slide decals that I made of Frankenstein um, using an inkjet printer and some clear water slide uh, decal paper. And the next step is to seal them. So I'm going to get some uh, 2X Rust-Oleum clear spray paint, give them a thin coat of that, then go over it with white, and then go over it again with clear. And that should uh, make it ready to go on to a black background on the helmet. And now a light coat of white. And that's to make sure that none of the black shows through in the areas that are supposed to be white, like the whites of his eyes. Here it is with the water slide decal applied. I decided to just use his head and not use the background that was in the image with the stone wall. It was just a little bit too, too big and too bulky. Uh, so I just did kind of a faint glow um, around his head with the airbrush and then um, put the uh, decal over that so now i'm going to take it i was going to do a clear coat myself uh, just using some cheap um, spray paint but i really like the way this is coming out so i'm going to take it to the guy that um, did the base coat and clear coat on my old uh, Sportster gas tank, if you've seen that video, and um, have him do the clear coat. That way it comes out with a nice, durable, smooth finish. 
and I'll show you the final result. And here's the final product. 